It's that shooting that has everyone talking about school safety. Absolutely. Gunshots fired near a Raleigh Middle School recently are prompting renewed concerns here at home as well. CBS 17's Haley Fixler is digging deeper into what Wake County school officials are trying to do to address this. Haley. Rod Angela, Wake County school officials told me that they spoke about the first phase of their security initiatives and projects during a closed door meeting this afternoon. And while they couldn't get into specifics, they say this is a top priority for them. Takes a whole community, takes a village, absolutely. Wake County School Board members getting a head start Tuesday and going over their safety audit. We got a chance to see them moments before they went into a closed session to discuss ways to prevent school violence and their emergency plans. This was a previously scheduled meeting, but made more critical by Monday's violence at a private school in Nashville, Tennessee, and outside of Lagan Magnet Middle School in Raleigh. The president of the Wake County chapter of the North Carolina Association of Educators, Christina Spears, tells us leaders should talk to the staff out on the front lines on how best to handle these safety concerns. And I think teachers are willing to work together and be a part of the solution rather than the problem. So I would encourage the decision makers behind me, the decision makers at legislators to really talk to public school workers about what's going to keep us here, what's going to make us feeling safe in our public schools. Now Spears but does not believe that metal detectors or more SROs on campus will help. She says that public schools are in the heart of each community. In order to address the problems, you got to go to the root of the problems to make a difference. Live in Cary, Haley Fixler, CBS 17 News.